So for this video, it's just like me just trying to wing it, how to assemble all the pieces together. Using the picture as my guide, I am aligning the holes on the piece on top to my base. If you can see here, there are two pieces that are similar to each other. So you put one on the left side and then you put another one on the right side like so. And then there's a pair of support brackets that you're going to put on top of your motorcycle rack. So this is the set of screws and nuts that are going to hold everything together. I do not know the name of each of this, but they all came with the package. Once again, checking the picture as my guide. Since it did not came with instructions nor labels, I just used the thickness of the metal to decide which screw to use for each part. At this point, I thought I was installing it wrong as it was not flush nor flat to the motorcycle rack. Good thing with a little nudge, I was able to fit it properly. This is the pin that should hold the ramp in place when the vehicle is in motion. Then this is the pin that should hold your motorcycle carrier to the hitch of your vehicle. Either side of your motorcycle rack have a lip that attaches to the ramp to load and unload your motorcycle into the carrier. And you can do that by doing so. This actually looks more secure than it looks. I'll see you next video for the installation of this motorcycle carrier to my Jeep Renegade. Till next time, see ya!